Well, welcome back to Daryl Arad Cafe and our uh, Tumblr experience this morning. We are seeing if we can get to the bottom of the Tumblr, the um, endless Tumblr scroll. So let's go back to Tumblr and see how far we can get with this one last video this morning. So we are uh, Jane, Jane Mansfield. The Poor Man's Marilyn Monroe. That's the first time I've seen a picture of her on Tumblr. So, we have already done two videos trying to scroll down to the bottom of Tumblr. And it's only been roughly 12 hours since the last time I've logged on to this site. Here's a photo of a wet Marilyn Monroe from 1962. Now this is uh, her an the anniversary of her death was yesterday. Uh, on this day in 1962, we lost a goddess. June 1st, 26, 1926, to August the 5th, August the 5th, 1962. Yesterday was the anniversary of Marilyn Monroe's uh, death. Which I I, I I saw that yesterday. There was a lot of photos blogged uh, celebrating the anniversary of Marilyn Monroe's death. If you go to a website called findagrave.com, you can actually it's a, a virtual website where you can uh, visit uh, celebrity graves in a virtual setting and leave flowers and write rate their star from one to four, you can give them one to four stars on, uh, you know, what uh, do you think they were, you know, uh, what kind of st star rating do you want to give them? You know, one star, two star, three star, four stars. And then you can leave like uh, different uh, flowers and other sort of types of uh, things like that along with the message and you can put a link to your blog and whatnot it's a very interesting website that I had found I think a few years ago that uh, that I have uh, I visit occasionally to uh, visit uh, you can't I mean some of these people are, are are buried in California and whatnot and it's not like you can uh, make a trip over to California or wherever you, uh, you know, whether it's Elvis or Marilyn Monroe or someone like that, you can't just hop on a plane and visit these people wherever they're interned. So it's kind of nice that you have a website like findagrave.com where you can visit their, their, their grave in a virtual setting and leave flowers and whatnot and pay your respects in that way. It's a it's a very good idea. Somebody whoever thought of thought of it, well, you know, it's a, it's an I think it's an original idea, and uh, I think it's a, you know it's a it's a nice it's a nice thing to do for for people. So we're uh, still scrolling along here. <clears throat> we seem to be getting nowhere. Absolutely nowhere. Loading more posts. We might be stuck here. Sometimes, no, we're not stuck. Sometimes I get stuck at that loading more posts and I got to log off the site for a while because it doesn't seem to want to keep scrolling. Another one of Marilyn Monroe. I shall heart that one. It's got 110, including mine, 110 notes. A note same thing as uh, if you heart it, it's a note. So, 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 so. I still got it. I know I hate it too. I feel like an out of work porn star. George Costanza with a mustache. And would he want to call, call himself Buck Naked? So this is going to be the last video here of the Tumblr scroll, I guess you might call it. 
Marilyn Monroe star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. She died 48 years ago today. What an iconic woman. 48 years ago yesterday, I believe. I'm not doing the math, I'm just reading what it says. So My brain sometimes works a little slow and uh, I have to stop and think in order to do that kind of math. So I'll just take their word for it that their math is right and uh, I don't have to check someone else's math. I usually got to check my own math. I'm doing my uh, my checkbooking, my checkbook and whatnot. I have to I constantly have to check my own math. Just uh, I have to use a calculator to check my own math. Here's a nice picture of James Dean. Should I heart that? I should I should heart it and I just did heart it and I'm gonna re blog it. Did you ever watch Happy Days when you were a kid back in the seventies? Fonzie would always uh, when he sort of got into some sort of uh, emotional crisis or whatnot and needed someone to turn to he would open up his closet and inside his closet on the inside of the closet door was a picture of James Dean and he would talk to that picture and that always kind of blew my mind when I was a kid because Fonzie always seemed to have it all together didn't really seem to need anybody and uh, the fact that his role model was uh, James Dean and he had the picture of James Dean on the inside of his closet door was uh, pretty freaky for me when I was like a 10 year old kid. I still got that uh, memory in my mind of him doing that. And it's not a picture that uh, is uh, very common that you see every day today. It's a, it was a very old photo of James Dean, maybe a not so recognizable photo, but you knew it was James Dean right off the bat. Even at my young t tender age of 10, I, I, I knew it was James Dean and I thought, wow, that's really far out, you know. Even Fonzie needed a role model, it would seem, or a higher power maybe. Anywho, so looks like uh, we are not going to get to the bottom of this today. Whoa, there's a photo that I blogged yesterday. We might actually be getting close to the bottom of this. It might not happen this morning, but it could happen later on today. So let's see how far we can get in the next uh, few seconds before we call it a morning or at least uh, we call it a morning for now. See, I'm probably following, this is my own fault, I'm following so many people that now uh, the more people you follow, the more media you have to go through, which is, you know, I'm looking for ver 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 variety, variety, so uh, I'm following a lot of people in the hopes that I'm going to get a lot of different media and a lot of variety in that media uh, in the hopes that I'll find stuff that I like and, and can reblog. I actually am getting down finally to the bottom of where I was yesterday. So I think we've done it. It's only taken three videos, almost a half hour to get to the bottom of Tumblr for for uh, what in about 12 hours it's taken me uh, a half hour to go through 12 hours worth of uh, media that's been blogged yeah there's a video there's a video there's a there's a photo I blogged yesterday and another one yeah we are there so we have reached, finally reached the bottom of Tumblr. And we're going to call this a morning and uh, hopefully I'll see you later on. So until then, take care.